Um, the nationalistic right with uh, Donald Trump Jr. and Tucker Carlson have attacked Nikki Haley for not supporting Trump in this election conspiracies. Do you think the GOP will split into two as there is no common ground with the nationalists? I, I don't think it'll split, but as I've said, this is war. And it, it, it doesn't surprise me at all, at all, that, um, that Nikki Haley is being attacked. I have predicted this. Again, if you follow my show, I have predicted for a long time that Nikki Haley does not belong to this wing of the Republican Party, that Nikki Haley will be outed, that Nikki Haley will be attacked, that Nikki Haley is going to struggle to gain traction with Republicans if Trump does not lose in a landslide. That is the problem with Trump losing by just a small margin is that it shows that the Trump wing of the Republican Party is amazingly strong and that will determine the shape of the Republican Party in, into the future and that Nikki Haley is not part of that future. So she'll be a Republican, she'll run for president in 2024, but she cannot win as long as Trumpism is the dominant idea within the Republican Party. So people like Tucker Carlson, Donald Trump Jr., Josh Hawley, um, uh, Tom Cotton, the senator, those people have to be thoroughly and quickly marginalized. They won't be, but that's what needs to happen. And people like Nikki Haley and Ben Sass and some of the better people within the Republican Party have to replace them as the dominant voices of the Republican Party. And... I don't know that there's anybody in talk radio because they all seem to be Trumpists. There's nobody on Fox, although in, in the, in the uh, what do you call it, in the, um, in the commentary part of Fox, there is in the news part of Fox, that can replace Tucker Carlson. He is the most popular of all of them. So I don't know how it happens. I don't know how you win that fight. But it's clear to me that that fight is coming. And then there's the pragmatist part that, the McConnell and the Graham and the, the, the nothing Republicans who stand for nothing. They'll be Trumpist one day. They'll go with another faction another day. They believe in nothing. They hold nothing. They stand for nothing, right? But there is a battle. Now, I don't think Nikki Haley is God's gift to America in terms of solving all our problems. She's just better, and she would drive the party in a better direction. Right? I want... Tucker Carlson fired? No. I mean, I, I want Tucker Carlson to fail. I don't want him fired. I want him to fail. I want the American people to turn against him. Unfortunately, that's not happening. He is more popular than ever and will continue to be so. Right. So, you know, that is, the, that is the challenge we face. The challenge we face, uh, uh, those of us who care about the Republican Party, the challenge we face is that the Trump wing of the Republican Party will continue to dominate that party. And, and as I said, Better people, even if they're marginally better, like Nikki Haley, have no place there. What we need today, what I call the new intellectual, would be any man or woman who is willing to think. Meaning, any man or woman who knows that man's life must be guided by reason, by the intellect, not by feelings, wishes, whims, or mystic revelations. Any man or woman who values his life and who does not give, want to give in to today's cult of despair, cynicism, and impotence, and does not intend to give up the world to the dark ages and to the rule of the collectivist brute. All right, before we go on, reminder, please like the show. We, we've got 163 live listeners right now, uh, 30 likes. That should be at least 100. I figure at least 100 of you actually like the show. Maybe there are like 60 of the Matthews out there who hate it. But, but at least the people who are liking it, you know, I want to see I want to see a thumbs up. There you go. Start liking it. I want to see that go to 100. All it takes is a click of a, a, click of a, a thing, whether you're looking at this. Uh, and, and, you know, the likes matter. It, it's not an issue of my ego. It's an issue of the algorithm. The more you like something the more the algorithm likes it. So, you know, and if you don't like the show, give it a thumbs down. Let's see 
your actual views being reflected in the likes. But uh, if you like it, don't just sit there, help get the show promoted. Of course, you should also share and uh, you can support the show at yourownbookshow.com slash support or on Patreon or Subscribestar or Locals uh, and, uh, and show your support for, all, for, for, for the work, for the value hopefully you're receiving from this. And, uh, and of course, don't forget, if you're not a subscriber, even if, you, even if you just come here to troll or even if you're here like Matthew to defend Marx, uh, then uh, you should subscribe because that way you'll know when to show up. You'll know what shows are on, when they're on. You'll get notified, right? So, um, yes, like, share, subscribe, support. Like, share, subscribe, support. There you go. Easy. Do one or all of those, please.